Hey friends and welcome to my channel. I'm Yoshida and this is Norris Cove. If you're new here, I'm a hair self-employed hairstylist. I get paid cash daily and through Cash App. I have a couple of side hustles. I own an Etsy shop and a Poshmark uh, boutique. And this is how basically I budget. So if you're self-employed like me and you want to see how I budget my money, um, please stay tuned and let's get started. Okay, you guys, so we're still in the boutique. I said I would print. I'm trying to do some bulk recording because I'm going to be kind of busy. So we're still in the petite and I'll fix up my uh, deluxe another time. But this is what December is looking like. If you like these kits, you can get these kits on my Etsy shop. I'll try to remember to leave the link below. It should be there. I've already just saved myself the trouble and you guys the agony of watching me lay these stickers and I have the headers here, um, my date dots in the new year. This will probably be a little different. And then here are my bill due boxes, everything. And I tried to write in some important things. So on the 21st, I have a wedding to go to. Um, the 5th, we're doing dinner. So let me show y'all a little bit of this kit. So here are your headers. I know it's a little racked up, mixed up, and I've already kind of gone into them. But here are your headers. So this one is still together. Let me make sure. This one may be out for a reason. Oh, okay, that one's good. And you get bill due stickers, flags, appointment boxes, and some more appointment boxes, total boxes. You get your strips for your totals and all that good stuff. Your cash envelopes, some calendar boxes, some washi, some more um, header boxes. Okay, I have doubled that. And then here are your icons, your date dots, your bows, your week one through five, your holidays, your paydays, all that great stuff. That might have went into the deluxe. I don't know. So I have an extra one of these. Let me save this because somebody, I think, needs a December kit. Okie dokie. And then some more total boxes. So... I'm going to get started. I'm going to hop right on in. So I'm going to write down some things that I would normally have to spend money for. So we're going to this wedding. So I have that down because, I, okay, let me just not, let me just digress. I'm going to have to spend extra Christmas money on this wedding because it's in December and that's fine and well. And then I'm going to take this little um it's like a fork and a spoon i'm going to use this let me get my tweezers because my co-workers and i we go out for christmas dinner that is sunday the 8th so i'll put that there and the, oh i already had it there okay well that's fine because it's not gonna come back up and then we have a ugly christmas sweater party i think the 14th um i just need to get a sweater last year i just made my own so that's all I have to kind of do. I'm going to go in. Let me find, see if I can find another pen. Pause, y'all. Let's pause for the calls. Let me try to find another pen. Okay, let's see how my AliExpress pen is going to treat me. So on the second, I have... Uh, what do I have to... I know it. Oh, Wayfair. And I'm going to give them $50 uh, on the 4th. Let's switch back over. Let's see what was doing the 4th. Apple and Amazon. And Apple's only 99 cents. Amazon is $12.99. And then Schedulicity is on the 5th here. And that's 20 That's my online appointment book. And then here's my total box where I write in my total. I need to make those bows a little smaller. They've just been like that for so long. And then here on the 11th is a card note I should have known. That's my card note. And that's 181.60, 30-something. Uh, that's all that I paid that week. Let's see. 
Oh, and the 15th, I have a sale bill due. I'm going to write that here. Sale bill is $148.29. Like I just made an arrangement because that bill is high. Then I had to get my daughter the phone. So that's the 15th. I have something else due on the 15th. Taxes and Capital One. My taxes are 100 Capital One. I'm going to try to give them 50. My minimum amount is 25. And then the 17th is the gym and Citibank. For some reason, I feel like the gym comes out before then, but I'm going to put them down. Gym, Citibank, which is like a Best Buy card, but I can use it anywhere. The gym is 20. Citibank, I want to give them 100. And I may give them some money prior to that date. Um, the 20th, I have car note and loan number two. Matter of fact, let me whip out some of these here. Because I have three things due here on the 20th. But I have the car note there. Let's see. notes and then I'm gonna have to stagger some of these I'm gonna use these flags here to write what else is all do the 19th is loan number one kind of went over but that's okay loan number one and my loan number one is a loan I have with my husband um, that's a hundred. It's actually like my second loan, which is like ninety-one, ninety-two dollars. But we always pay a hundred. Um, car note one eighty-one sixty. Loan number two, and that's a hundred. Now, what else was on that day, the twentieth? And I thought it was something else. Okay. Yeah, actually, loan number one is the nineteenth. And I sometimes like to move it here to the 18th so I can go ahead and maybe cash up him the money. And then here on the 21st, y'all know what? My car note due on the 21st. Or is it? No, it's the 20th. Sale bill is due on the 21st. Maybe that's the problem. No, because they take it out. So I have a bill due on the 9th, the 29th of 148, but I'm going to put down the 148 here. And then the 23rd. I don't know what's due on the 23rd. Oh, two, buddy. Because I had it in the wrong day. Two, buddy. That's $4.50. And then the 26th. What is due on the 26th? Oh, XM Radio. That's $6.06. And then I have a bill due here on the 28th, which is my car insurance, life insurance. Well, last month it was, we're going to put 219. We're going to see how that goes. And then that's it. So let's talk about some goals that I want to achieve. I'm going to stick with the 1500 from here. And I'd like to make in my shop, which I think would be pretty close. I want to make like 300 dollars I really say five but three hundred dollars I'm pretty close to this number now so I want to just kind of make sure I get there not close but close enough um goal number three uh last month I had to pay off um pay down credit pay down credit I want a new computer I really want me an Apple computer so I want to pay down my credit before I even kind of look into that as an option. And I have an empty box, so if something else pops up here, I'll definitely um, add that. So now let's get into laying some stickers here in the back. Uh, I hope this video is not too long, but we've got to get this stuff done. Let's see what we got here. Wait a minute. December. Here I'm going to do my am I going to do expenses here? Weekly check-in. I think
think let's do expenses because it's easier to I change it every time That one's off a little bit, but that's fine. It's just for me. So we have expenses here. Let's see. Expenses. Total expenses. Let's do item description. So that one was off. That's why that one didn't go anywhere because it's here with me. Just for me. So I'm just going to wipe that out because it's going to kind of drive me kind of crazy. Okay. So for the item, let's just go and look in at um, our bills. I always like to start with my car note. So what I think I'm going to do, instead of doing car note number one, car note number two, um, three, what did I say? 38320, I think that's it. Okay, car insurance, life. I'm going to put that at 219. Why am I thinking I put the wrong thing up here? Totals, total income. I don't know. We'll, we'll get into it. Okay, car note. Make sure y'all can see. Car insurance, Capital One. I want to give them, I really want to give them a hundred this month, but I'm going to put 50 if I do more, then that's fine. Uh, Citibank, um, I want to give them a hundred for sure, because that's my higher credit card and I really want to pay that down. Um, let's see. I like to do from highest to lowest, but I'm just going to do in the order they come. Wayfair. I'm going to give them 50. Let's see. Apple, Amazon. Schedulicity. That's 20. Uh, car notes. Oh, darn it. I'm just, I did car notes. I really hate white out stuff all the time. Okay, we already <clears throat> got the car notes. Aflac, that's what we need to put down. Aflac. Do we have five weeks this month? Let's see. One, two, three, four, no, four. So it is $30. I have to pay an extra $12 when it is five weeks. Taxes and Capital One. We already got Capital One there. So taxes, state taxes. Yeah, the IRS has been fooling with me for about 10 years, just messing with me. And I'm just over it. That's why at one point I didn't put down my income because I didn't know if it was them. You know, just craziness. So the gym. So I think in February is when I paid that extra fee. I just paid one in October. Loan number one. That's $100. Loan number two. That's a hundred. Get my car note. Hold on. Two, buddy. And you guys, I'm no um, expert at budgeting. 
I'm not no, I'm no financial advisor. I am just me, and I'm self-employed. When I first started budgeting like this way, the pretty way, I really wanted to design stickers to um, for my uh, my self-employed, my hairstylist, my people like that. And so I had booth rent stickers. I had little check mark things. I just had something. Let me see if they're in here. And now it's funny because now I see everybody has the little, um, let me see if they're in here. They're in here. I see everybody has these little check stickers now. And I was like, I had those. I could have been making money on them. But I'm going to find that for you. Hold on. I don't know if I'll be using my mini in the coming year. I want to, but I'm not sure. Just not sure these little boxes here can you see them I was making these little boxes back in February now I see everybody have them so I don't have I don't think I have any more printed so I have to find the file and I'll probably be bringing those back to the shop I was just doing squares and I may just leave it at the little squares but I love those okay anywho off that horn right quick I may be adding the that as a part of you know budgeting so this is it. This is what we have. So let's just do a calculation. Hold on. Y'all, I got totally sidetracked. Ain't that something? <laughs> Total totals. And then we're gonna do income, our income for the month. I like to put totals down here at the bottom because girl. Sometimes things get added and I don't no, there we go. So let's go ahead into the back into our other things that we need to do. So let's do income. I know that one don't fit. Yeah, sometimes what happens with my um, silhouette, I'll save a file, I'll save the measurements, and then it just does its own thing. But I'm okay with them being all for me. I just white it out. But I like for it to be perfect for you guys who purchase from me. And I'm very particular. I like I will not. I think um, when Elise first ordered something from me, I was like, uh-uh. I went to go do my budget and I saw it was off. I was like, girl, please hold. Let me <laughs> let me send you the correct one. Uh-uh. Don't use that. Okay. Income estimated. I need to go over these again. Make sure I have the right ones. So this is the monthly income. I'm estimating from here. Uh, I'll say 4000 I like to just keep it there. That's a nice little cushion for me. Um, Etsy, I'm guesstimating 300 That's what I want. Now let's get total income. And if you're not a you know, a pretty planner and you just like pen and paper, that is fine and well, it works. The only thing is, make sure you check it all the time. I never, when I did pen and paper, I would check it for a little bit and then I would just be off on to something else and I wouldn't check it. So, now let's see what else we got to do. Um, I have another header somewhere. Here we go. Weekly check-in. Put that over here. Where's my way out? I'm trying to find a way to kind of so if you ever get one of these, it's all backwards for me. Accept my apologies, but I'm trying to, I think I figured out how to get it to stay. So these were printed back in like October, I think, maybe September. Okay, weekly check-in. So 
what we have week one. Um, I think it was uh, Trika. She ordered a kit from me, and I love the way she did hers. She put it, like, to the side, and I thought that was interesting. So I'm going to try that myself. Oh, I'm going to do it here like this. I normally lay it this way, but I'm going to... Well, I just like I'm such a creature of habit, y'all. It just don't make sense. Okay. Hold on. You know what? We'll put sinking funds here. Under, I just want to save some. Okie dokie, I'm going to put cash envelopes. And what we're tracking in our cash envelopes are grocery products. Etsy supplies, uh, planning a better me, Vegas, and I'm going to leave room. Those are the top things that I want to track. And then we have, well, actually, planning a better me is sinking funds. Darn it, Yoshida. <sighs> that is not right. That goes under something else. Grocery products, Etsy, uh, supplies, gas. And I think those are the top. And I'll put variable expenses right up under that. Because these are some variable expenses as well. And then I'm going to... Y'all, here go the expenses, budget, and actual. What in the world, Yoshida? I done got all mixed up. Okay, let's take this total box. I'm going to leave room. Just in case I change my mind. I want to add something. Okay. And then next we're going to do sinking funds. I'm not going to add that big old piece. We're going to do sinking funds. Okay, it's crooked. It's okay. So, in sinking funds, we have planning a better me. We have Vegas. We have Christmas. You know what? We won't have Christmas because we'll be using... Christmas. We'll start over Christmas in January. Um, there's something else. Car. And right now those are the only three things I have there. So I'm going to go ahead and put in my first week of December what I plan to make. December is kind of busy. Tips will take a sister over. So that first week I'm just going to put in. I got to start low. For some reason my first week is always slow. I'm going to put in 700 you know what? Here. Etsy. Put it on the wrong line. I gotta look back and see what I'm missing. 700. This would be a plus and a minus. 
but we'll get to that. Okay, you guys, so this is it. This is what we have. Um, hold on, I'm trying to find... Since I have an extra one of these, I think I'm going to take this income estimate and actual. It should be two of those. Okay, so you guys, this is my budget for December. Let's see if we can stick to the budget. Let's see how much we can save. Oh, savings. Savings is in sinking funds. Thank you for reminding myself. All right, so that's it. This is what it's looking like, the monthly view. This is how it's looking. Again, if you're interested in any of my um, budget stickers, I will leave the link below so that you can purchase you some. I would love for you to, and I pray that you enjoyed them. Um, there are reviews there, so take a look at them. Also, you guys, thank you to all my new subscribers. We have hit the 300 mark. Woohoo! There will be a giveaway at the 500 mark. I'm going to be giving away a couple of things from my shop, maybe even some cash envelopes. So, tell all your friends that we budget over here. We do weekly spreads, we do DIYs, and all that great stuff. So, thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!